So, do you know the name of this author, A.G.? <sighs> A.G.! Y yes sir! Your answer, please? Uh, huh? Um... Jeez. Stay focused! Then, Haruka, can you answer the question for him? Kenji Miyazawa. Correct. It'll be on the test, so make sure you remember this. Especially you, A.G. Dude, that guy is always spacing out. He's probably just thinking about anime girls all the time, dude. He's always doodling something in his notebook. What the heck? That's mad creepy. It's basically true, so I can't really deny it. My name is Eiji. Just like everyone says, I'm an anime-loving geek who always draws pictures. Plus, I'm socially awkward and I suck at communicating. It's rare nowadays to find someone who fits the stereotypical image of an introverted geek as much as I do. I'm aware of this, and I'm used to people making fun of me for it, but... <laughs> She's at it again! Ever since we got assigned seats next to each other, I keep on randomly locking eyes with Haruka-san, but she's a super popular gyaru with modeling experience in magazines. Her fashion and makeup are on point. I must just be way too self-conscious even for an introvert to think that she's gazing at me, but... She's definitely glaring at me, right? Did I do something? Our only point in common is that we happen to be in the same class, and that we both chose art as an elective. I'm sure I didn't do anything to upset her, but... <laughs> Real-life gyarus are so scary! Gyarus are so... Nothing beats the 2D world! All right, let's upload and check on the picture from yesterday. Wow, already 10,000 likes! That's totally to be expected from pictures of copyright characters. They're super popular. There's quite a lot of comments too. Getting to see my wifey and fried chicken Daifuku-san's design, I'm totally lucking out from this. I don't know where the character is from, but she's so cute. Style on point. Loving the vibe. Seriously has really good taste. Yeah, I'm an introverted geek, but I've got another side to me. I'm a popular artist with over 10,000 followers. Drawing cute girls is my forte, but not the unerotic type. My art is what you'd call trendy or pop. Because of this, people get the wrong impression of me at times. Oh, not again. This girl's lip makeup is totally Twilight Orange from Maho Maho's line. I wonder if Fried Chicken San wears the same. Please tell us what makeup you recommend. Recommend? It's not like I wear any, so... Because I've mastered trendy pop designs, people on social media just started assuming that I'm a girl. Well, it's not like I'm gonna reveal my face online no matter what, so I don't really mind, but... Oh! Curry jiro san posted a new picture too! Cool stuff as always. I'm so jealous of people who can draw robots. On top of that, he's not even using digital tools? That's insane! 500 likes for yesterday's post, huh? I guess talented work and popular work are two different things. What a waste. Such high quality but no growth in followers but I'm jealous of the artistry. All right, it's good to sometimes change things up. Let's work on some traditional illustration. It's good that I made up my mind to do this, but I just realized that I ran out of my darker pencils during art class. I stopped coming here since getting a tablet, but it's sometimes nice to go old school, huh? Huh? Oh, uh, uh, 3D, S sorry. Wait, stop running away. I said wait. <sighs> Why did you run away? <sighs> That's because you started chasing me. <sighs> You're the one who started running away first. That's because you always glare at me so much at school. I thought you had it in for me. I didn't mean to glare, but there's something I've wanted to say to you ever since I got assigned seats next to each other. W what is it? Do you happen to be, um, fried chicken daifuku? <laughs> How did you... I've had a hunch from way back, but when I got a glance of your drawing, I felt it has a similar vibe. It has the same composition as what you were drawing in class yesterday, right? I'm starting to get somewhat famous, but I didn't expect a gyaru to figure out my identity just based on my designs. So you're the one drawing a ton of pictures of girls like this! 
for a dude you sure are familiar with cute gestures and fashion of girls. Seriously creeped me out. Damn it. She's totally looking down on me. At this rate, I'll become the laughing stock of the class as the creepy artist trying to pretend to be a girl online. I can even picture her exposing me on my account. I'll end up with nowhere to go, even online. What a hopeless future. Excuse me? Are you even listening to me? At least say something when someone compliments you. Huh? I'm super jealous. I mean, you can draw girls so cute that even girls get creeped out. Honestly, dude, I'm frustrated. Frustrated? I like drawing too. I'm confident in my art, but I can't get any likes online. W wait a moment. Do you also draw, Haruka-san? Not just for art class? Yeah. Anything wrong with that? Check this out. Th this diehard traditional illustration of mecha anime characters. Could you be... Kurijiro-san? Huh? You know about my account? I've always admired your work. It's really good and shows real talent. But I didn't expect it to be yours, Haruka-san. It's a hardcore geep type of account, right? Yeah, but what of it? W well, it's not rare nowadays for celebrities to be into anime and games, but Agyaru is a mecha anime artist. I'm just drawing stuff I like. Well, my dad's a mechanic, so we've always had tons of catalogs of machinery lying around the house. So I've been checking them out since I was little. I mean, isn't it out of character for you too? Y you're right. My sister got me really into shoujo manga. I've been drawn to cute or dreamy things. I enjoy imagining things that would never happen in real life, so, um... So basically, you sort of want to give form to the concepts of awesome, dazzling, or ideal stuff you think of, right? Y yeah I guess it's something like that. I totally get it. I'm the same. So I tried convincing myself that I don't really care about the number of likes, but I spent quite a lot of time drawing them, so... Yeah, generally speaking. Illustrations with highly saturated color schemes or those of characters are popular on social media. High precision or diehard pieces tend not to really get much recognition. Yeah, that's so true. Yeah, I figured. But for stuff like this, you could draw the body in monochrome colors, use red or neon colors for the camera eye, and add contrast to up the impact. Even if for traditional art, make sure you properly adjust the saturation figure out which parts get cut off as a thumbnail, and your piece might give off a pretty different impression. I got it! You're really paying attention to the details with your drawings. And, dude, that was super easy to understand. I'm gonna start calling you Master from now on. What? M master If anything, I'm the one who has questions to ask. Like, how do you draw such precise, detailed work? Mm, in my case, I just keep drawing a whole bunch of things I find awesome or cool. Uh, awesome. Huh. Thanks to my master, the illustration I just posted already got 1,000 likes. Huh. I can't just sit around. I gotta keep going, too. So when determining the solution... Haruka-san isn't glaring at me anymore. So I guess she was glaring before just out of genuine curiosity about my drawings. Keep drawing a whole bunch of things you find awesome, huh? Dude, Heiji-kun, you can't go around infringing image rights. Shigeru-kun, what do you mean by image rights? Don't play innocent, dude. You were drawing stuff like this the whole class. B wait Stop it! Damn! Drawing pictures of girls? That's creepy, man. Plus, doesn't that look like... That's Haruka from during class, right? Stealing glances at a girl's face to draw her is super gross. Th that's that's a major turnoff. Isn't that the same as secretly taking photos of her? What are you guys making a fuss about over at my seat? Look, Haruka. This guy over here was drawing this. I is this meant to be me? Geeks should just stick to being into 2D anime characters. Can't you tell the 2D and 3D worlds apart anymore, dude? Ew. Even though we got a little closer yesterday, Finding out that I was secretly drawing her is probably gonna bother her. That's true. It bothers me. I knew it. That you guys are making such a big fuss over just a drawing. What a real turnoff. You're acting like an elementary schooler, dude. What? 
We just have an assignment to draw each other in our elective art class. That's all. See? What the? Are you for real? Do you still have something you want to say about our drawings? That's... Huh? How'd it go? What's going on? Shigeru and his buddies here are getting the wrong idea and being super childish about it. Childish? What the heck? So what happened is... It's nothing. I just really didn't know what was up. I'm sorry. If you're gonna apologize, it's not me you want to apologize to, but Eiji. Not only did you make a huge fuss over everything, but you gave him a hard time. Uh, sorry. It was all a big misunderstanding on my part. D don't worry about it. I don't really mind. What a weirdo. Anyways, let's walk home together, Haruka. Um, sorry. I need to finish up an assignment from art class. You can head out before me. Assignment? One where I need to draw something I think is awesome. Right, Master? Thanks for earlier. Oh, right. You're talking about Shigeru, right? I've always found him annoying, so I just told him off a little. But I didn't expect you'd also be drawing a picture of me, Haruka-san. Like I said, I just keep drawing a whole bunch of things I find awesome or cool. Does that mean... I mean, that's why you were also drawing a picture of me, right, A.G.? Yeah. Then it looks like we're both into each other. Let's start dating! Things I find awesome. Dazzling and cute. I always just thought all that stuff would be irrelevant to me in real life, but... I... I look forward to spending more time together! <laughs> me too! This 3D real-life gyaru made all my wildest dreams come true.